We all face it, right? Not getting the things we want in life. Whether it's the money we want, the love, attention, the girl, and so on. But this is the wrong mindset. You see, you are seeing the act of receiving as something separate. But in reality, receiving something is decided by a universal law that has two parts, receiving and giving, or the law of giving and receiving. This law tells us that giving and receiving are universally connected, intertwined with each other in a flowing state. And so, because of this circulation, both parts need to flow, need to thrive, in order for the other to appear. That means that you will need to give love, give attention, spend money on good causes in order for it to receive it, in order for it to come back to you. But for now, choose a place where you can sit without someone interrupting you. Notice how you're set. Is your back straight? Your shoulders relaxed? Now close your eyes. Begin by taking some deep breaths, in through the nose and out through the mouth. When breathing in, try to expand your stomach as much as possible without moving your chest too much. If it helps, you can lay your hand on your stomach. And as you breathe out, notice how the body relaxes more with every outbreath, how the tension just slowly fades away. Do that a couple of times. Then just return to the natural rhythm, breathing in and out through the nose. Focus on your senses. Do you feel your body on the chair or on the floor beneath you? Your feet on the floor? Feel the points of contact. And feel the balance point, the middle of the body. Now, notice the sounds around you. Take some time, the pleasant ones and the unpleasant ones. The ones close to you, just outside of the room maybe, or further away, perhaps a bird or a car. Then bring your attention back to the body. Notice how it feels. We don't normally check up, but today we'll take some time. Any parts that feel tense? A bit stiff maybe? Does the body feel light or heavy? Then come back to your breath still not breathing in any special way. You might feel something traveling up and down through your body. Can you feel the air going into your body, into your lungs or stomach, wherever you feel it best? And can you feel it go up again as it leaves the body? Just place your attention on the rhythm for a bit. It's perfectly normal if you get distracted during this phase. But when you do, accept the distractions 
let them slowly float away with the wind, like a cloud that just has passed. Again, accepting the distraction without getting mad, just acknowledging and letting it go. Now, I want you to think of a time when you gave someone something with sincerity. It can be a compliment, a message you sent, or maybe you've bought them some food. Do you remember how the other person reacted? Do you remember their spark of happiness? Now feel this spark of happiness in your body. It starts small, like a little pinprick of light. This feeling of light, warmth, ecstasy. With every outbreath, you feel it slowly expanding until it covers your whole body. And when it does, just sit in that state. Feel the warmth, light and happiness. Remember, this all started from the spark of the other person's happiness. Now bring your attention back to the body. Feel the contact points again with the surface beneath you. Listen to the sounds around you. And when you're ready, slowly open your eyes again. So how did that feel? 